Today we will let us see the uh, octal arithmetics. So before going to the octal arithmetics, let us see uh, what is an octal number system. So this octal number system usually have uh, total 0 to 7 digits. Total number of digits it contain is 8. Uh, so is also called as base 8 number system. So each position in octal number system represented as uh, 0 power of the base 8. Uh, for example, uh, the first digit is 8 power 0 and so on. So whenever I want to write an octal number system, I must always make sure that to write the base as the number system base that is the octal number system is 8. Now let us proceed to the octal addition. Now the octal addition uh, table will help you to handle the octal addition. So whenever we come across a normal addition like uh, the decimal number system, what we do there is whenever we get an, a two digit in the addition process, we will be doing a carry over there. Something like that. Here also I have some trick. Whenever, uh, please observe this table. So writing 0 to 7 in the vertical and 0 to 7 in the horizontal. So if I want a 0 plus 0, what will be the result means a 0. So 1 means 1 plus 0 is always 1 and 2 plus 0 is always 2 and so on 7 plus 0 is always 7. Now coming to the second row if I repeat uh, 0 plus 1 is 1, 2 plus 1 is uh, sorry 1 plus 1 is 2, uh, 3 plus 1 is 3 and so on like that uh, 7 plus 1 is 1 0. That is after 7 we do not have 8 uh, so we are going with a octal addition as 10. Like that, uh, let us see one example here. Now, example of addition. Now, I would like to add 4, 5, 6 and 1, 2, 3 here. My resultant in the octal number system should be 601 uh, base 8. Uh, now, let us see how it happens. So, now if I take this example, now 6 plus 3, what is 6 plus 3? 6 and 3 is 11. So, I am writing 1 here and giving a carry. So, 5 plus 2 is 5 plus 2, 5 and 2 is 7, 5 plus 2 is 7. So, I got 7. Again, 7 plus 1 is 10, 7 plus the carry 1 is 10. So, 0 here and carry 1. So, 4 plus 1 is 5, 5 plus again 1 is 6. So, I am getting 601 uh, uh, as the addition. Now, the octal subtraction, if you see into the octal sub subtraction, the subtraction of non octal numbers follows the same rule as the subtraction of the numbers in any other number system. The only variation in the borrowed number in decimal system, you borrow a group of 10, in binary number, you borrow a group of 2, in octal number system, you borrow a group of 8. So, if you see the example here, 4, 5, 6, minus 1, 7, 3 is giving triple 3. How it is giving, let us see here. Now, as we know that 6 minus 3 is always a 3, but uh, yes, 6 minus 3 is always a 3 and uh, we are representing uh, the 3 here and uh, moreover, now 5 minus 7, it is not possible. So, I would like to borrow 1 from here. So, if I borrow 1 from here, I will be getting a borrow of 8 uh, such that uh, 8 uh, plus 5, it is 8 plus 5, it is 13, 13 minus 7. So, 13 minus 7, it is 6 and 3 minus 1, it is 2. So, the resultant is 2, 6, 3. So, which is equivalent to 179. Okay. All right. So, this is how we do the uh, octal subtraction. So, now coming to the octal multiplication, whenever I want to perform the octal multiplication, what is the procedure I follow generally in other thing in decimal number system is simply whenever I get a two digit, I will draw, I will write one digit here and the other will be going as a carry. But when it is coming to the octal multiplication, simply what are the numbers I have, I will multiply and without giving a carry, I will write it here itself. Now, 6 5s are 30, 6 2s are 12 and 1 5s are 5 and 1 2s are 2. 
so this is how i will write then i will do the addition so resultant 30 17 and 2 now let us see once the addition process completed now as this 30 17 and 2 is not the correct multiplication resultant so first i need to find out the number which is very close to this one the multiples of 8 so the multiples of 8 which is very close to 30 is 8 3 that is 24 so as it is going 3 times give a carry of 3 and subtract 24 from 30 and similarly the 17 plus 3 is a 20 the number which is very close to 20 is 16 so 16 uh, subtract 16 from this 20 and give a carry of 2 why you are giving a carry of 2 means 8 twos are 16 so now as we are um, subtracting 24 and 16 30 minus 24 is 6 uh, 20 minus 16 is 4 and uh, the remaining 4 will be written as it is so this is how we are going to perform the 